Welcome to BioVid episode 2. My name is Leslie Samuel and in this episode I'm going to be giving you an introduction to neurons. Inside this video I'm first going to talk about the definition of a neuron, then I'm going to talk about the four main parts of a neuron, and lastly I'm going to talk about the three types of neurons. However, before we go to the definition of a neuron, I want you to imagine a situation with me. Let's say you're at home and you're getting ready to cook a nice meal. You turn on the stove, but then you get a call from someone that you haven't heard from in a long time. You get on the phone with that person, you start talking about life, and, and it totally slips your mind that you had the stove on. A little later, you walk into the kitchen, and not thinking about it, you take your hand and you rest it down on the hot burner. Now, you can imagine with me that at this point, you will not be smiling like this lady in this picture. As a matter of fact, you'll probably look a little more like this lady. But let's think about what's happening right now. There's intense stimulation that is sending signals to your spinal cord and to your brain. There are signals sent back to the muscles in your arms that tell the muscles to contract so that you can pull away from that intense stimulation and not experience the pain anymore. There's signals being interpreted in your brain as immense pain. So there are a lot of signals that are traveling throughout your nervous system. Now that we have that situation in your mind, let's talk about the definition of a neuron. A neuron is a very specialized cell that forms the basis of the entire nervous system. It's also referred to as a nerve cell. And these cells are specialized in that they send signals throughout the body and they can do that really rapidly. This animation gives you an idea of how these cells can send signals from one to another in a very rapid way and actually it happens significantly faster than what's depicted here. Let's talk about the four main parts of a neuron. First we have the dendrites and these are points where the cell receives inputs from other cells. Then we have the soma or the cell body and this is the part of the neuron that is most like any other cell. It is also a place where the neuron receives input and it's a place where there's a lot of processing happening. You can find the nucleus of the cell inside the cell body. Then we have the axon which is where the signal actually originates so that it can be sent all the way down to the axon terminals. And the axon terminals are the points where it connects with other neurons and sends signals to those other neurons by releasing neurotransmitter. And we're going to get into that in a later tutorial. There are three main types of neurons. First we have sensory neurons and these are neurons that send signals to the central nervous system. And if you remember from the previous episode, the central nervous system is made up of the brain and spinal cord. Then we have motor neurons that send signals away from the central nervous system and to other organs and muscles and tissues and glands and so on. Lastly, we have interneurons. And these are neurons that are contained fully within the central nervous system. So it's within the brain, within the spinal cord, and where a lot of the processing happens. To illustrate this, let's imagine you're being touched by someone or, as in the first example, you touch a hot stove. Signals are going to be sent to the central nervous system and this happens via sensory neurons. Then, let's imagine you're out on the field playing a game of football and you're getting ready to kick a ball. Well, the central nervous system is sending signals to the muscles in your legs and it does that via motor neurons telling those muscles to contract in a certain way so that you can kick the ball. And of course there are interneurons in the brain and spinal cord doing the processing and also serving as a connection between sensory input and motor output. To recap on what we've discussed in this video, first we dealt with the definition of a neuron, secondly I spoke about the four main parts of a neuron and lastly I spoke about the three types of neurons. That's it for today's episode, I'll see you on the next one. Oh,